Sister Wives' latest update, Jen Sullivan mocks Cody Brown, calling him Mary's a flower girl, while Robin gives an awkward farewell gift. Cody spirals, declaring, this is the end, as Mary leaves for Utah, Christine gets engaged, and Janelle moves on. Fans wonder if Cody's dream is officially shattered. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day, after watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Jen Sullivan takes a stab at Cody Brown's kidney. Sister wife's newcomer Jen Sullivan is a great friend of Mary Brown and TLC fans love that she took a stab at the kidney of Cody Brown. Not physically of course, but who can ever forget him describing his hurt by Christine Brown as being stabbed in that organ. Fans question the sobriety of Cody Brown. For over a decade, the patriarch of Sister Wives treated Mary Brown very badly. He gaslit her, told her he didn't love her, and worse. As time went by, the penny dropped and finally, Mary decided to get the heck out of his life. She wanted a formal release from the church, as well. Some TLC fans wondered if Cody Brown had been drinking when he suddenly decided that he would miss Mary Brown so deeply that he started sobbing. It just seemed bizarre, as did Robin Brown who cackled with laughter when Mary said that Cody should help her move her stuff to Parowan as a form of severance pay. Jen Sullivan stabs at Cody Brown. If things had not been bizarre enough for Sister Wives fans, in the latest episode of the TLC show, Cody Brown declared that he wanted to walk Mary down the aisle the next time she marries. You really can't make this stuff up, it seems. After babbling on about wanting to be part of Mary Brown's next chapter, Jen Sullivan beautifully stabbed Cody Brown by saying, Would you be the flower girl? Shots fired Jen. Who needs a friend like Jen Sullivan? Probably everyone on the planet. Needless to say, Cody continued to make a fool of himself. TLC star Mary Brown seemed justifiably confused. While Jen Sullivan was sharp and sarcastic, Mary naturally seemed confused by her formerly toxic ex speaking about Cody Brown, the Sister Wives star said. The fact that he's saying he wants to walk me down the aisle when I get married again, I'm like, like, why would he say that? Is he serious? Is he trying to make a joke? Well, at least the TLC star has a friend in Jen Sullivan to stand between her and Cody Brown who blustered, you know, until the next guy, you know, you're, you're when you, if you marry again and everything like that. I mean, I won't be weird about it. I get to walk her down the aisle. What are your thoughts about Jen Sullivan taking a stab at Cody Brown and asking if he wanted to be the flower girl at Mary's next wedding? Are you shocked that Cody Brown suggested he should walk his ex down the aisle next time she marries? Today's next update, Cody Brown reveals, this is the end. Cody Brown is now revealing that, this is the end, in the mid-season trailer of Sister Wives. He has finally watched Mary Brown leave and move to her BNB in Utah. Now, it is officially just him and Robin Brown. Yet, there are more changes afoot and it may be too much for him to take. Cody Brown reveals, this is the end. After Mary Brown officially shared she was leaving Flagstaff for Utah, Cody Brown knew it was over for them. He had long said they were done, but it appeared he did not think she would actually up and go. More so, he claimed he had an obligation to his wives therefore he would stay married as long as they were around. Furthermore, Janelle Brown shared she did not care to reconcile, which was hard for him to comprehend. Finally, his former third wife, Christine Brown Woolley not only moved to Utah, but she met someone and is now engaged. This means that his plural family and all of his polygamous dreams have officially been shattered. In the mid-season trailer, Cody can be seen aggressively chopping down a tree. He does so in a way that scares Robin who he is later talking to about whether or not this life is enough. She says that this is not what she wanted. Cody is also freaking out over the fact Janelle is now moving to North Carolina and he was not informed. To him, he believes he was not meant to find out which is true. All of this is happening around him and he has no control. His ex-wives also wanted their stake in Coyote Pass, which he now decides he does not want to give up. As he and Robin's five kids are grilling on the land, he sees all of his dreams shattered. That is when Cody Brown says, this is the end. However, he does not specify what that means. Is it the end of his dreams? The official end to the plural family? Moving on from CP? Fans react to what's next. 
After seeing this, are Sister Wives fans shocked at Cody Brown's reaction? It seems he's always a catastrophist so this is normal behavior for him. Robin coming into this family was the beginning of the end. End of the family and needs to be end of the show. How long must we all listen to Cody whine about his marriage you messed up live and learn from it? Essentially, fans are sick of Cody complaining constantly about the failings of the family when they feel it was all his doing. They will just have to wait and see if he cracks or keeps it together. Today's next update, fans think Robin Brown embarrassed herself with Mary. On this week's episode of Sister Wives, Robin Brown said a tearful goodbye to Mary. The episode featured several uncomfortable moments, but some viewers think their goodbye was the worst of all. As Cody and Mary loaded the moving van, Robin stopped by to wish her former sister wife well and to leave her with a parting gift. See what fans had to say about the scene. Robin Brown's parting gift for Mary seemed out of place. Over the course of Sister Wives, Robin always claimed she and Mary were incredibly close. When Mary wanted to go back to school, Robin begged her to stay and work on my sister wife's closet. Most fans believe Robin didn't truly care about Mary. She just used her for her own benefit. Viewers found her parting gift to Mary incredibly bizarre too. The journal was very garish, and few thought Mary actually would use it. But rather than make a fuss, the TLC star accepted it gracefully and hugged Robin. Goodbye. Please tell me someone got a screen grab of that fugly journal OMG, one viewer shared on Reddit after the new episode aired. Robin was so proud of it and I am highly embarrassed for her. She made the whole thing about herself and then Mary had to comfort her. Sheesh. One user did manage to grab a photo of the journal, which they put in the comments. Most viewers didn't understand why Robin chose a journal for Mary with such a loud cover. Some thought it would have been more appropriate for a little girl. Sister Wives viewers felt uncomfortable during last night's episode. Other Sister Wives viewers agreed, pointing out that Robin very clearly made the moment about her emotional pain. But after 19 seasons, most also agreed this was typical Robin behavior at this point. Comments on the Reddit thread included. Mary looked like she was going to trash that thing the first chance she got, and I also got the impression that she is very, very over Robin, she was almost cold to her, rightly so. She also basically unwrapped it herself, instead of letting Mary open her gift. Typical. Robin's friendship is as fake as her tears. Mary was so solid and didn't seem to have time or care for Robin sucking the energy and oxygen out of the room. Hopefully the journal goes in the trash along with that bedroom set. Thanks for watching this videos, please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.